Hey everyone, Tim Schofield from QBKing77.com here doing a video showing you how to install a custom recovery on your Samsung Galaxy S4. It's quite easy, it's actually very simple. One quick prerequisite is that you must be rooted. So if you are not rooted, you need to do so. Just click on the link in the description of the video below and I have a full uh, guide showing you how to root. It's very simple. What you need to do is go ahead and go into the Play Store and install an app called Goo Manager. You'll see I have it right there. Just Google Goo Manager, one word in the Play Store and it should come right up. Go ahead and download and install it. It will ask for super user permissions once you open it on up. I'm gonna hit remember choice forever because I do trust this app and I'm gonna go ahead and allow it super user permissions. Now, very simple, uh, it's a very simple process. Just press the menu button and then go ahead and hit install open recovery script and it says confirm recovery install. Go ahead and hit yes. What it's gonna do is find your specific uh, image file. You'll see there uh, the last three letters there before .img say SPR, that lets me know it is the Sprint variant. I will post a link in the description where you can check each and every variant uh, so you know it's downloading the correct file. You might want to double check that if you don't know what the file name should be, but again, I know this is the Sprint version uh, of Twerp, so it's going to install Twerp, which is what I recommend. I'm going to go ahead and hit yes, and what it's going to do is take it to this site. You just got to wait 10 seconds and wait for the download to automatically start. All right, so that screen went away, and you'll see it is downloading right there. Again, if you're not, uh, if you're on 3G, it might take a little bit of time to download the file. But once it's done downloading, it should actually automatically install this uh, recovery file, and then you should be just about good to go. All right, you'll see installing recovery image, and it says recovery has been installed. So that should be just about it. That should be all you need to do to get Torp recovery installed on your Galaxy S4 now. Um, to get back into recovery, you can do it manually or um, you can just go ahead and press reboot recovery and hit yes. And what that's going to do is automatically take us into recovery. If you wanted to manually reboot into recovery, what you could do is power off your device, press and hold volume up, home button, power button all at the same time until that Samsung screen lights up and then you can let go of all three of them and it will take you back into that recovery. So if you want to manually do it, feel free to do so. You'll see Team Win Recovery booted right up. First thing I highly recommend that everyone does is making an Android backup. So just go ahead and press the backup button and then the three things you're going to want to backup, you can uncheck cache, is boot, system, and data. You want to make sure you have all three of those backed up. Then just go ahead and hit swipe to backup. Once it's done, if you ever want need to restore it, just go to the restore button and you should be good to go. So that's just about it. It's a full touch screen recovery. You can wipe here, you can do a factory reset. There's an advanced wipe menu where you can wipe certain caches. You can multi-select and then you can also install zips from the install menu. So you can go ahead and find them, your ROMs, your customizations. You're ready to go. So now you have a custom recovery and that's it. So to reboot, just hit reboot system and then you should be good to go. So my phone should reboot and you should now have a custom recovery in your Galaxy S4. If you have any questions, feel free to ask, leave a comment. Please subscribe to me, I'd really appreciate it. You can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Google Plus as well. All links will be in the description video below. And as always, thanks for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up.